God is really using his son, Apostle Chibuzo, to do all this and many more using the tithes and offering in Opium Church. Since I was born and now I'm getting old, I have never seen someone with Kwashoko, not until I saw this family. This is something we read in books and heard stories about, but it's happening in real life is something I would never have believed. These people were living the worst kind of poverty, being able to afford just Gary and whatever they made up as soup, eating just once a day. The four children were all suffering from Kwashoko due to malnutrition. The compound they lived in is a swamp and at the entrance it had a crooked bridge which is likely to collapse at any moment. The house had so many open holes where reptiles of all kinds could enter into. A good Samaritan that went to clear his bush close to where these people were living took pity on them and called the attention of a video creator who in turn related the matter to Apostle Chibuzo Gifchinui. Instantly, he asked that they be moved to OPM Free Specialist Hospital, but due to the complication of their case, they had to be transferred to UPTH. Barely three weeks of their stay in the custody of the man of God, you all can see the visible change in their lives. Poverty is indeed terrible and something no one deserves to experience.